Hi, I'm Patrick with uh, Just Ponics, and today we're gonna show you how to test your bell siphon. After you set up your kit, right before you added the grow media, you wanna test your bell siphon to make sure it works before putting in the gr grow media. Because if it doesn't work, you're gonna have to take out the grow media and readjust the bell siphon. So turn on your pump once you have your uh, once you're ready, and your pump just start pumping water into the grow tray. The water will continually pump into the growth tray until it hits the tip of the inner riser. That's where the water will start um, draining down into the aquarium. And after about five to 10 seconds, the siphon should start and you just see your water level lowering faster than the, the water that's being pumped in. So let's wait until it reaches the top and you'll see the siphon activated. Now the siphon has been activated. You should see the water draining down on the bottom. If it's a smooth flow like the, what you're seeing right now, and then you know your siphon is working. And if you look in the grow tray, the water should, level should be lowering. It should slowly be lowering. It'll take a while for the water to lower, but once it reaches about half an inch, Above your grow tray, the siphon will stop and then the water will again start to rise. So let's wait. And now your siphon has broken. And you'll see once it breaks, no more water will be coming from the bottom of the siphon. So just uh, look, some little quick tips. If your siphon doesn't break, that may mean that your water is being pumped into the tank too quickly. If your siphon doesn't start, make sure that all the connections for the siphon are properly screwed in. Thank you. I hope you uh, have fun. <laughs>